All right, we're here at the bandsaw. As you can see, my fence is about three and a half inches away from the blade. I have my safety glasses and I'm slowly ripping down our XPS foam. You can do whatever size that your bandsaw can cut. The maximum height that my bandsaw can cut is three and three quarters or just a little bit less than that. So I'm doing the maximum that I can do and then some shorter boards at the same time. Once you have all the boards ripped to the length you want, then you're going to want to resaw them. It can be any size that you want. Just be careful with your fence. Make sure your fence is parallel with your blade. Uh, my particular fence has to be at a little bit of an angle in order to cut straight. Um, different bandsaws cut different ways. Um, you're actually going to have to uh, test your bandsaw to see which way it cuts correctly. It's just like resawing a piece of wood. Um, the only difference is, is the foam cuts extremely easy. As you can see here, I'm just resawing even smaller blocks for smaller projects. This works great for um, doing 3x3 three three tiles, for um, gaming tables, to making bases for castle builds or anything else. Um, the bandsaw is a very universal tool. It is uh, a dangerous tool at the same time. It can actually cut your uh, fingers off um, very easily. As you can see, I always keep my fingers uh, safely away from the blade. I mark my tools I push with and stuff to make sure my hands are in appropriate places. And that's just the basics of resawing um, XPS foam or even wood. Thanks for listening.